In other news, global leaders in biotech are in San Diego now for the Bio International Convention, which lasts all week, and we'll cover topics like cancer therapies, brain health, and even the latest trend in cosmetics. Megan Tavrizian at the uh, downtown convention center. I, I didn't realize how big this thing was until I went on the website. She's got this story. People from all over the world will be here at this convention. Former British Prime Minister David Cameron and Anne Romney are keynote speakers here later this week. But today, what's breaking news has to do with genomics. For the next four days, some of the best in the life sciences industry will be here, talking about the latest trends and breakthroughs in biotech and pharma. San Diego has really emerged as sort of this natural platform for... And one of the hottest areas in San Diego's biotech sector is genomics. You've probably heard about genetics, where you can isolate one gene and link it to a specific disease. Well, you've got a whole lot of those genes, and collectively, that's the genome. Genomics, at its core, is mapping the human genome, which can lead to understanding a person's risk for disease and how to treat it. A lot of your genetic makeup actually also affects how you respond to drugs. There have been a lot of studies about San Diego's biotech and research industries, but there's never been a study specifically on genomics until today. The San Diego Regional EDC found San Diego's genomics industry is a leader in the nation, second only to Boston. And we're very, very close to Boston, and easily within striking distance, and I think with a little bit more emphasis on this, with a little bit more collaboration and a little bit more focus, we should be giving Boston a run for its money long into the future. If you can imagine, uh, if you could personalize medical treatment, um, how transformative that would be. And it's transforming the San Diego job market, too. Over 115 firms are here, including Illumina, the largest sequencing company in the world. Genomics provides over 10,000 direct jobs. Its economic impact is $5.6 billion, and that's expected to grow. But it really is the talent and the that's piloting the effort in San Diego and continuing to move us forward. And our local schools are providing a lot of talent to this job market, too. San Diego universities provide the most genomic students than anywhere else in the country. Megan Chavrizian, NBC7.